how do we curb forest fires? We've had, you know, we've had fires for uh, long before the Europeans showed up here, and our indigenous people uh, had a different way of of living with nature. For ten thousand years, there was never more than three hundred thousand. Now we have forty million, and we have a totally different situation. So it's not one thing. It's people, it's how people live, it's where they live, and it's the changing climate, uh, the drought, the lack of mo the d diminishing moisture, uh, and all the rest of the things we've talked about. And uh, the truth is, and I don't want to be giving any happy time news, uh, we're going to have more difficulties. Uh, things are not going to get better. They're going to get more challenging because of the continuing alteration in the climate, uh, lack of moisture, early snow melt, um, and... Uh, faster winds, the whole thing. So uh, the issue here is not pointing a bunch of fingers. It's first to be uh, very clear, crystal clear about what is going on, what do we face, and how do we get out of it. There'll be plenty of time for accountability. But at the end of the day, uh, it's us that have to deal with it. So there is no other over there, because at the end of the day, it's the federal government, which our taxpayers provide, it's the state government, which our taxpayers provide, or it's the, the um, utility users that uh, put up a lot of the money, or it's some shareholders. So we, we will work it through as best we can. But make no doubt about it, this is not a neat, nice, simple proposition. It's, it's messy, it's complicated, and it will, I'm afraid it's going to get more difficult uh, in the years ahead. Yeah. For, for Secretary Zinke, uh, follow up question. Um, see how fast we're starting to be. Hi. Uh, it's good to see you again. Um, regarding the president's tweet a few days ago, did he, the president of Milwaukee, did he single out California, blame California for one thing? Well, certainly California has had, you know, f the, far, the four biggest fires. <laughs> and as the governor points out, there's a lot of people in California. As interior, I got a bill for about $870 million this year. And that was just to repair infrastructure, repair watersheds. That didn't include fighting the forest fires. So this is a national issue. And certainly California being a, an economic powerhouse, uh, very populous and influential uh, state, when something of this, of this nature happens to California, uh, then people pay attention. Uh, uh, certainly people paid attention last year in Montecito. Uh, for the first time you heard me, may, maybe we should manage our forests a little more. Uh, because if you, if you burn them down to the scale that, that we are, and you had the landslides, uh, loss of life in Montecito, I think there was just around 20 people. Uh, this is much higher. So what are we going to do? Uh, we have to work together to manage our forests, looking at, at uh, health, return the health of the forest. It starts uh, with working together uh, for common solutions because this is unsustainable. <laughs> and the loss of life, uh, and now people are in shock uh, because they have lost their homes, uh, but they've lost their lives. A lot of people did get out, you know, fortunately. Uh, but this is unacceptable year after year after year after year, uh, season after season, these catastrophic scales. It used to be a 5,000 acre fire was a big deal. Uh, this year we've had the car fire, the t uh, last year the, car, the Thomas fire, the Montecito fire, this fire, uh, the one down in, uh, in, in Los Angeles. These are huge, huge fires. And I got to tell you, the, the backside of it is, you got to repair the repairing banks. Uh, a lot of these fires are going to go areas that were previously mined. So you're going to have runoff that's going to have hazardous materials. You're going to have hazardous material runoffs from, from paradise that's going to go in the watershed. You have a dam uh, that's sitting there. And the, this is where the federal government and the state government uh, have to work together to address these things. Now, we are in recovery stage, and we're still fighting forest fires out there. There's still an active fire. Uh, we're still looking for people to make sure we have the number of uh, accountability of who's lost. There's a lot going on. Um, but as we go forward, we're going to have to face the rainy seasons coming. 
that's going to set a new set of challenges for us. So you don't have the Montecito uh, issues in there. And the only way to do it is uh, Americans as Americans uh, have to stop, uh, step up. Is, 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 we're not finger pointing here. Uh, we're all in the same, same boat. Uh, everyone loves California. I certainly do. Uh, I want to see, see California thrive. I want to see healthy forests. And uh, I want to go and, and have a steak dinner when the governor retires. Paradise, you know, in Santa Rosa, the, the supplies, uh, the, the labor, it's skyrocketing. People say, right. people say home they had. is there anything the state can do to prevent that from happening? Well, we do have, uh, as part of my executive order, we, uh, we uh, prohibit uh, price gouging and things like that. Uh, but we are in the midst of a, of a catastrophe, and catastrophes um, unfold over time, and the government uh, is doing things. We can do more, uh, but that's the nature of where we are today. That's why we call it a tragedy, uh, and now we have to live with it. But I can tell you, uh, the state of California uh, will do everything we can, and where we find people gouging or acting improperly, uh, we'll take action. The attorney general will take action, the local prosecutors. But we still are, are, are faced with all the things you've heard today. And so we have to work it out uh, as, a human, as a human matter. We all have to work together. So the easiest thing is to try to identify uh, one source of our problems and then kind of pick on that. I think it's much different than that. We, we are in the problem and we are the solution. So it's not going to be easy, but we'll get it done. I have, we are not a poor state. We have the resources. We'll get it done. No, Can, I'm not going to talk about that. That's a legal matter that we have the most expensive lawyers in the world that will argue it out in exquisite detail. So I'm not going to, I'm not going to add to it.